let's take a look now. Uh, Champions League semi-finals: uh, Liverpool versus Roma, Bayern Munich versus Real Madrid. Uh, obviously the toughest uh, draw there being Bayern Munich versus Real Madrid. Uh, Real Madrid to qualify uh, priced 1.8, uh, looking to uh, make history uh, with a third win. Um, but Bayern Munich certainly won't take this uh, lying down. We've got uh, Anne S as well. Obviously, she's not happy with the uh, with the draw. I can understand. Uh, she is a uh, she's from Germany, so going for the probably going for that Bayern Munich win. I'm guessing. Uh, start us off. Let's start with uh, well, start us off, Alex, on this one. Liverpool versus Roma. Uh, what a win uh, for Liverpool. What a win for Roma heading forward. But I think Roma's uh, Roma's chances I think stop now uh liverpool to win 1.6 their value in that and do you do we expect to see liverpool in the finals no value on that uh, i think that we should expect uh, again goals uh, in the first leg uh, when uh, liverpool are playing uh, i think that the biggest um, uh, surprise in the not in the history but uh, recently Roma to beat Barcelona to overcome that uh, 4-1 defeat from the first leg. Uh, Liverpool easy wins against Manchester City. Mm. I I didn't thought that I will ever say that, but yeah, easy wins. Um, yeah, I I hope for the sake of football, for the good of football, Liverpool will win the trophy. I'm yeah, going for that, well... but the odds are the odds are really low at 3.5. But hopefully, hopefully. For, I think that the gods of football needs to come down on earth and see the beauty of football right now. Because, I know, I yeah, know. Real Madrid Real Madrid are really good. Bayern Munich are really good. Um, As Roma are a tough uh, opponent. We saw that. I don't think that Barcelona... I think that it was the mistake of Barcelona, not that As Roma played uh, good. I think that Barcelona played bad, from my point of view. Um, yeah. But, uh, yeah, it will be... a in the final, anything can happen, you know. So I see Liverpool in the final in uh, in Kiev, and uh, hopefully uh, I will see also Bayern Munich priced at two point two to qualify further in the final. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so you think so? You think it's a Bayern Munich Liverpool final? Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, for the sake of football, yes. For the sake of football, uh, big man Liverpool Roma. I have to say, of all the draws that Liverpool could have had, you could argue the same as well with Roma. But I think that Liverpool will will qualify. I think Liverpool have definitely got the uh, got a good draw here. Uh, they don't have to face Bayern Munich or Real Madrid uh, just yet. Do you see Roma do Liverpool advancing? And are they and out of Bayern Munich and uh, Real Madrid? Who they're playing? Uh, yeah, you know, who would have thought that a in the first leg, a garbage goal from Eden Dzeko uh, down 3-0 would have put them into the next round? Uh, interesting. Uh, that's what's so interesting about football. I'm really at the end of matches. You got to play to the end because you never know what that late goal, those late goals will do for you. And obviously it proved huge for them getting the away goal. But I'd have to think the magic will run out here. Though I do think, uh, and uh, who was it here? Uh Oh, Lamia Saeed makes a good point. Uh, they're very good at home, Roma. We saw against Barcelona, uh, they're really defensively uh, sound at home. Uh, they have some, obviously, some very good players with, you know, Dzeko and, and, and Kolarov and, and Al Shirai off the bench and all these different players. They're, they're pretty solid, but I have to think Liverpool will win. Uh, I think they'll be in the final. I have them at 9-1 to one to win this tournament, so I'm obviously rooting for them. Uh, the other matchup, the other fixture... Like, it's hard for me to swallow, really. Um, we all know I'm a Juventus fan, and I, I would like to have seen uh, John Luigi Buffon. I think he deserved it. Um, I'm still mm -hmm. shocked at that decision. Um, but um, I'm not going to jump shark, Natalie, in this, though. I do think Liverpool will advance. It's hard to not envision it. This is probably one of the easier matchups they could have hoped for. Yeah, no, absolutely, absolutely. Liverpool to qualify uh, from Liverpool Roma, 1.44. Liverpool to reach the finals, uh, 1.46. Um, who will be joining them, Nigel, in the finals? You, obviously, I, I'm not sure if you've checked the uh, checked the markets here. The name, the finalist, still has got quite a cool, a lot of value. Liverpool, Real Madrid, 2.38. Bayern Munich, Liverpool, 2.88. Which one gets you money right now? Uh, Bayern Munich. I'm, I'm amazed that Bayern Munich are the uh, clear favourites to beat Real Madrid in the in the um, in in to make the final. I thought Bayern Munich could be a lot lot shorter price than Real Madrid. 
Real Madrid scraped through. I mean, and, that, and they haven't been impressive pretty much all season. I mean, they've, they've had a good bit of a run towards the end of the campaign, but throughout the season, they've been far from impressive. And Zidane was a manager who was under pressure, who was talking, leaving his job. Whereas Bayern Munich are, are, are just an unstoppable force at the moment. They, get, they went through the motions in the second leg against Seville because they had already done the hard work. I, I think Bayern Munich are a, a big, big price to beat Real Madrid. I really do. Apart from Ronaldo, Ronaldo as we know, is a world class player, probably the, the best player in the world, or one of the, you know, if Messi or Ronaldo, obviously between the two of them. But um, I think I think Bayern Munich are a big price to win that game. I think like, Liverpool will, will get through, and I think it'll be Klopp running into old Bayern Munich again. There's he does the Dortmund games, and Klopp just has this horrible record of, against uh, Munich. Uh, whenever he's managed Dortmund, whenever he's ran, gone into a major cup final, he's always run into Bayern Munich and he's always come second best. And I just got a feeling that that's going to happen again. But the way Liverpool are playing, the confidence they're playing. And you know what, Nat? If, if you look, I know it might sound silly, but the way Liverpool are playing and the way their confidence is and how strong they are, the bet now is not even in this competition. It's Liverpool to win the Premier League next season. That's the bet. Yeah. I think Liverpool... I, I, uh, I, think, yeah, I think if you... Great. I, th- I think that's the bet you want to have now. If they're the champions of Europe, they got Salah, they're going to spend again. It's going to be a World Cup year. Klopp will bring in four or five new faces. They'll get another centre-half alongside uh, Van Dijk, who's been absolutely immense. Uh, they'll get another striker and probably a goalkeeper, and, and they will be a very, very hard team to bet next season. So I think the bet now is probably back in Liverpool for, for, the champ- for, the, for the Premier League next season rather than the Champions League. Yeah, I like the way you're thinking there. I, I think uh, definitely worth. Who, who, who's uh, uh, big man, Alex? Are you uh, are you uh, thinking Liverpool winning the Premier League next season? Uh, yeah, it's, I mean, it's hard to envision that they won't at this point. <laughs> I mean, there is this great thing called money, and you can go out and buy things that you need. Uh, they obviously are the favorite, in my opinion. Uh, you know, City obviously will come back and they'll make changes. And, you know, United, <laughs> look, I, until they get rid of Mourinho, they're not winning anything, I don't think. Uh, I do want to uh, make a quick point, though, on the Real Madrid uh, uh, stuff. I agree with uh, Nigel. I have to feel at this point Bayern Munich uh, should be the favorite. I do want to also say some kind of uh, my point here on this, because unfortunately on the morning show that I do, uh, my co-host Donnie Wright said is not a, a soccer guy. He doesn't know anything about it. So I find myself uh, devoid of being able to talk about this stuff. Uh, but I do want to discuss the incredible, awful, hideous, disgusting, sickening beat yesterday on Real Madrid minus 1.5. Uh, it was absolutely heinous um, in the 93rd minute, 30 seconds to go. Uh, Malaga, a team that I think has scored like 25 goals all season. Uh, scores a goal uh, with uh, like 15 seconds to go, and the minus 1.5 goes down in smoke. Just in stoppage time. Sick. In stoppage time. In yes. Sto- with 15 min- with 15 seconds to go in stoppage time. Yeah. It was my banker <laughs> of the week in the best bet show. Real Madrid minus 1.5 goals. They fucking drew in it in the last seconds of the game because of. Uh, I think that it was also a foul also there in the in the area. Uh, this is. This is my belief. But when when uh, <laughs> when you see Real Madrid uh, going 2-0 up and uh, nothing not, not having any interest to uh, to push further because they could score another three goals at least and to destroy and to close the game in the in the first period of the game. Yeah, it happens like that. We are lucky sometimes. We are unlucky uh, the other times. But Luck had, is the part of the they game. They had 19 goals going into that game. 19 goals in 32 games. Yeah. Guys, I'm going I'm to I'm gonna have to bring you back. Guys, I'm going to have to bring you back to the Champions League because this, this video is actually going to be clipped and put into our Champions League article. So I'm sure us ranting about uh, the match in about a week's time is not going to be relevant. So I just need to ask... Um, uh, sticking with the Champions League, any value on any bets that we can take right now? Obviously, we, we, we've done sort of our predictions, uh, who we think. Obviously, Liverpool is a clear favourite uh, to advance, to reach the final 1.46. Any value, Nigel, right now in uh, in um, in any of the bets, any of the futures that's uh, been uh, offered? I think the value is on Bayern Munich. I think Bayern Munich to qualify Absolutely. in their match over Real Madrid. I think uh, if you can get them the underdogs in this game, I think, they, I think the world should be the other way around. The only reason Real Madrid are the price they are is because mm-hmm. they've got history on their side and they're, they're defending champions. They've got a brilliant Champions League record, but on current form, Bayern Munich are in a different league to them. Yeah, yeah. Um, 
two point to their uh, Bayern Munich to qualify um, over the two legs. Uh, what about you, Alex? What are you going for? I'm on the same page uh, as Nigel. Uh, Bayern Munich to qualify at 2.2. And I'm going a little bit further saying Liverpool to win the trophy at 3.5. All right, fantastic stuff. I'm big man. Finally, uh, what do you go for? Uh, I'm going to go with uh, Bayern Munich and Liverpool, and I'm going to go out on a limb. I think Liverpool will win this competition. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm hoping... I'm hoping so. I started a thread over on the Bookmakers Review. I'm going to put the links uh, below uh, so you guys are watching. If you guys want to like head on over, uh, come chime in. I put Liverpool to win uh, the Champions League as well.